Are you just a little cutie? Oh, you're just such a cutie boy. Okay, so I still haven't answered the question, why am I leaving the Lightning? I'd love to sit here and say there's an easy answer to that, but it's actually a lot of reasons. I'll start with one of the ones that's not that easy to talk about. I didn't really feel like I was growing anymore. I felt like I had kind of hit a plateau. I was doing my job and I was doing it the best I could, but I, I didn't really feel like I was growing anymore. And a few of my bosses had left over the years and I felt like I wasn't really getting any new opportunities. And that's nothing against anybody that's still there now. It's just, there's so many things going on that it's hard to come up with new ideas. And obviously you guys know I love to be in content. I love to do stuff and I felt like I, I just wasn't a part of that plan going forward of doing content related activities. And for those that really know me, you guys know that I am not a corporate person and doing you know the day to day office stuff is just not my style. And again, I wanna emphasize, this is not me complaining at all. I'm super thankful for the years at the Lightning, but I feel like if I don't give you guys the reason why I'm leaving, then I'll just be asked for eternity. So I'm just gonna give you the reasons why I'm leaving. So reason number one, I wasn't growing, kinda hit a plateau. Why else could I be leaving? This is a big one, so hold on. Time. What do you mean time, JP? You got plenty of time. Don't you just play video games for like four hours every night? Well, yes, technically, but also no. It's a lot more complicated than that. You see, I would work nine to five. I would come home, edit a video and stream and maybe go to bed by one or two in the morning if I'm lucky. Also, I'm so sorry. I know I'm walking and doing a lot of talking. This is probably very shabby camera work, but we'll rock with it. So yeah, working yourself literally the entire day, not the smartest, not only for you know your mental health, but your physical health. I'm dealing with a lot of health stuff right now. And every doctor's told me the same thing. You work yourself too hard for too long and your body's basically telling you, stop, take a breather. And thanks to your guys' support, I have an opportunity of a lifetime here but we'll get to that in a second. So obviously time for my health is important, but also time for my friends. Uh, guys, you're, you're looking the wrong way, turn around. Yeah, my friends, and don't mind my outfit. I'm kind of a fashionista. But you know, I felt bad. I always had to tell my friends, you know, no, I can't do this, and no, I can't join the stream tonight. I got work, or I got a hockey game. And again, that's no complaint. Like, I did love working for the Lightning, but at the same time, I felt bad and uh, I mean I've mentioned this a few times but the loss of our friend Zombie or Tyson it, it hit me really hard in it and it, it kind of opened my eyes to a lot of things I hadn't considered before and the final and honestly probably the biggest reason that time is such an important factor here is you guys um, I feel like I have a very unique opportunity here to do something big on this channel and unless I can give it a hundred percent of my attention I just feel like I'm never gonna reach that potential. I feel like I've really plateaued in the sense of the amount of time that I'm putting in is the results I'm seeing. I'm seeing great results here. I'm seeing great results on Twitch. The support has been insane, but I know, I know I can do better if I just had more time to focus on. Honestly, the last reason I'm leaving is I just know that it's my time to move on. You know, sometimes in the back of your head or maybe in your heart or whatever you want to talk about, you just know, you know, you just know all of my years of making content. I've never once put 100% of my time into it. So here we are on a brand new channel, which the gaming videos are still going up on at JPW03, but here at JPW03 Vlogs or Jeremiah Woodward, my actual name, we're gonna be making content about this new journey, about being a full-time content creator, taking you guys behind the camera a little bit into what it's like, what does my day-to-day -day look like? And let me tell you, I'm so excited for the adventures that we're about to go on, whether it be traveling, whether it just, you know, be playing with my dog here, or pickleball, or whatever else it may be, the world's our oyster. And I'm not gonna rush to do all these crazy things because you know what, you know, it's funny, my running coach mentions this all the time about running. We got the time and we got the distance. So just enjoy the journey. Thanks to you guys, we, we have the support to be able to do awesome things and let's just go do something awesome. I don't think it's any secret. I'm not the world's best video creator. I'm not the world's best editor, but here's what I can promise you. I'm gonna work my tail off to do the best I can do. And I don't care if it's not the world's best because you know what? I'm doing my best and I'm gonna learn from it and I'm gonna keep learning and I'm gonna keep getting better day by day. And ultimately, I'm gonna do the best I can for you. So if you're in for the ride, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Join me, Jeremiah Woodward, going by my real name, guys. What is this for the next journey? of being a full-time content creator for the first time ever. Never done that, feels so weird to say that. 
but I'm so excited. Genuinely, thank you all so much for all the support over the years. It's gonna be weird not working two jobs, but I'm excited. So genuinely, from the bottom of my heart, thank you all so much. Thank you for watching this video. And yeah, you know, all the YouTube stuff, leave a like if you enjoyed, comment, you know, whatever you wanna do. Ultimately, just thank you. So here's to the next chapter. See you guys in the next video.